When Wolfsburg can get near the ball, which is difficult versus this Barcelona team. Here they come, Barcelona, and straight away, within the opening two minutes, they found the opening goal, Aitana Bonmati. And that is a perfect start for the home side in front of another massive crowd. It's a good run by Bonmati. It's a longer ball. It just one ball beats both centre backs. And to say such a small player, so strong, Bonmati gets herself in front of Janssen. And there's only one winner there, one on one. Terrific finish. Aitana Bonmati makes it 1 0. A huge win for them, and then 3 1 in the cup as well. Jenna Gorcevic gets away from Jonsson. Now, Graham Hansen can keep on going. Graham Hansen to make it two! A brilliant finish against her former club, Barcelona, well in control, and they've got two. It hasn't started how they wanted it to start. They've allowed Barcelona to get right into this game. And that's a, that should be that that's a defensive error. Sunogorcevic managed to get it inside for Graham Hansen, but then she keeps a nerve, ice cool in front of goal, and she's got that finish as well. And to be honest, as much as the possession that Barcelona have had, the goals have come from defensive mistakes, and that was one defensive mistake, and they're just putting themselves under pressure, and this tie is just running away from Wolfsburg. It's her second goal in the Champions League. She scored against Real Madrid. It's Torrejon. Bonmati. Kihara with a lovely ball in to Torrejon again. Out to Hermoso to make it three. They're having fun now, Barcelona. Jenny Hermoso. With the third goal for Barca, inside half an hour, played. Wolfsburg just cannot cope with the passing and movement. Look at Torahon, nobody's tracking her. It's easy for her to get forward. And also, that is another cool And that's the thing, they get in front of goal and they just don't panic. Take a touch, and also knows exactly where she's going to put it. And Schultz done all right for Wolfsburg, but she's let three goals in. And that's all about, they just cannot cope with the relentless bodies and the movement. Our lovely ball in now. Here's the captain, Alexia Puteas, to make it four. Four nil Barcelona. And of course, Alexia Puteas had to get involved too whether it's full-back or it's centre midfielder, but look how open they are there. They're trying to play offside there. Hendrik, absolutely no chance. And Pateas will quite happily hold a run. In terms of defending, you cannot defend against anybody in the Champions League like that, Wolfsburg, never mind Barcelona. Here's Weissmuth, who's got time to drive forward here for Wolfsburg. Leaves it for Gillard! But the flag is up against her, so it won't count. Wolfsburg, who got themselves a glimmer of hope. That's terrific play from Farswell. She did look, actually, in the naked eye, she looked like she was level or onside, and it was a good finish, but I have to say that it's the first time that Wolfsburg have connected good enough passes that have made the right decisions. Patea steps up. It was a knee penalty. Barcelona have five. And the crowd inside this stadium have gone wild for this group of players. And just absolutely chilled under pressure. Completely enjoying and reveling in this atmosphere, these Barcelona players, who just love it. And best player in the world.
Russia here for Leon. T. Buchanan. This is stolen from here to Brits. Quick ball in to find Katoto. Tight angle. Oh, she slid it in. Mary Antoinette Katoto with Paris Saint Germain's first meaningful attack of the game stuns Leon, who had started the brighter. Can be PSG lead 1 0. Yeah, brilliant centre forward play. Lost it out wide really cheaply at Leon, but it's too easy. We're talking about Wendy Renard, but she let Katoto pass her far too easily, let her turn give her that much space and even from a tight angle you've got to get closer as a defender too easy for Katoto to get past Renard I think Renard thought that she was going to side foot and goal scorers do not pass it they just try and get it past the goalkeeper and to say all the pressure that Leon have had in the opening stages of this game what a goal that is on the day in which she becomes the first player to hit a hundred appearances in this competition has the chance the Leon skipper to level things up against PSG it's Renard, it's 1-1. Cool as you like from the Lyon captain. And we're all square. It was that good a penalty. Tikova goes the right way, but still couldn't stretch out and touch it right in that side netting. Oh, they've got themselves back in it, great game. It's living up to expectations. She's another enjoying a very good season, Melvin Mala, the 21-year-old, 16 goals for the campaign. One of those coming at this stadium against PSG. It's a nervy ball out by Posikova. And Leon could be in here and are in here. Katarina Macario gives the hosts the lead. It's an error by Posikova and it's been punished clinically. Leon 2 PSG 1 from Macario started well but that first touch from Hegerberg is what set it up you know it's not often that actually looks really easy and it, it really isn't when a goalkeeper hammers the ball at you like that you first touch just allowed her to play Macario in and then she's got to keep her head hasn't she get the ball past Botikova probably a little bit too easy as far as she's concerned but Leon won't care and PSG are just ruined that Experienced Brazil international. And injury absence. Macario trying to work room for the opening. It's well defended by Dudek. Oh, almost. Botikova doesn't know what to do here. Oh, and it's in. Awful defending by Paris Saint Germain. And Macario takes full advantage once again. I think initially, Gioro did really well defending against Macario. She just tried, just got a toe poke in the end of it. And then over just get rid of it kick it away I mean uh, she was thinking that she in her head she was thinking that she couldn't pick it up because she thought it was a back pass and I'm not sure it would have been given as a back pass and if you pick it up then the referee's got a decision to make but you've got to do something you've either got to kick it or you've got to put your hands on it and she did neither the do deck I'm not sure that that would have been given as a pass back Botikova just needs to get rid of it put her foot through it pick it up Christiane Endler who was so outstanding against Leon last season now will attempt to deny Paulina Dudek from the spot the Poland captain up against Endler and scores it's a great penalty Endler got something on it but the power was too much and Paris Saint-Germain are back in this Leon 3 PSG 2 and Dudek steps up and puts it past and I think she got something on it maybe fingertips and you heard something in the pitch microphone but she probably could have done better Endler will watch that back and say it was at a good height for me but maybe a little bit too much pace and do that make sure that's